Yo, what is up guys? It's Zenny. Today I'm going to be teaching you how to free up space on your C drive. So to start things off, the first thing you want to do is you want to click on this PC. Once you click on this PC, you're going to click into your C drive. You're going to find Windows in your C drive settings. And once you do that, you are going to scroll down until you find Software Distribution. Go to Downloads. And what you're going to do is you're going to press Control A and then you're going to click Control Delete. On to the next step. Alright guys, so the next step that you're going to want to do is you're going to want to open up a run. You open up a run, what you're going to want to write in here is clean MGR. And you're going to click OK. And then you're going to make sure this is selected to your C drive and click OK. Basically what this is going to do is every single file that you don't necessarily need in your C drive, it is going to delete. So you're going to want to make sure that you select all of these. And once that is done, come back to the video. So for this third step, we're going to go back onto run. And now once we get in a run, all we're going to write in is app app wiz dot cpl. Once you click into that, it is going to pop up everything on your PC. In your C drive. Now, what I would say that you do is sort this by size by clicking size and going through these applications that you are not using right now. And all I would do, is, and then I would uninstall. Now, this is all for your guys' preference, but this is the best and most effective way of freeing up space on your PC. All right, guys, so the next step here is we're gonna go back into run. Once you're into run, this time you're gonna wanna go percent temp percent. And you're going to click OK. Now, this is all the temporary files that are just being held up on your PC. You see how many I've got? Like, the last time I cleaned this was a long time ago, so this is going to free up a lot of space. And if you don't do this manually by yourself, then none of this will get cleaned. So you're going to want to do Control a which will select all of them, and then you're going to hit Delete, and you're going to want to skip. Now, some of these files it will not delete, but you're going to try and skip again and try and get as many as them as you can get deleted but if you can't get them all deleted then it's perfectly fine and once you do that you're going to exit out of that find your recycling bin right click empty yes all right guys and just like the last one we're going to go back and run we're going to this time put in pre fetch and click ok now you're going to want to click this now just like last time you're going to click all of these folders you're going to want to do the exact same thing do this skip Try and get as many of these as you can. Just like last time, we're gonna click out of here. We're gonna right click on our recycling bin and we're gonna empty recycling bin. If you guys are on Windows 11, if you are not still on Windows 10 and do not feel like going back to Windows 10, what you can do is you can go into your C drive and this is only if you don't want to roll back to Windows 10. You can delete Windows old in general. It will delete a lot of space off your PC. You'll have to get a bit of administrator roles, but this will delete a lot of space off of your PC since you are no longer going to be using it. Now, guys, another one that we can also do is temp, but this time it's without the percentage signs. You might have to give it administrator role, but that's okay. You want to go through here and do the exact same thing and go out, right click, and remove those as well. If you guys did enjoy this video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe if any of these did help you. And if you do want a tutorial or a how-to video in the future, please let me know down in the comments. Have a good day.